Greg Ruff along with you, and with me is Logan Rogers, the Great Midwest Athletic Conference Athlete of the Week for track this, the very first week of the year, and just talk about your meet at Vanderbilt. You guys got out there uh, quickly this year. Yeah, we. Uh, our goal was to uh, just go out there and try to hit some fast times early on in the season so we could relax and build up our base um, heading into the, you know, the Christmas time of year. And so, um, you know, for the 5K, the distance people, um, we were on a different training plan than the mid-distance people. Mm -hmm. And so um, while the mid-distance guys were just going in there just trying to hit a meet and just get one meet out of the books, um, Ben and Chachi and I, um, our goal was to just go and try to hit a fast time, get a PR, and uh, maybe qualify for some meets that we're trying to get into later on in the year. He says Chachi. That is not Scott <laughs> Bayo for you Happy Days fans. That is Josh Winsky. <laughs> yeah, just Josh to clarify. Yeah. Because yeah. uh, when I hear Chachi, you know, my era, they think of uh, Scott Bayo from yeah. Happy Days. But, yeah. Uh, he has like four different names. Yeah. He's, he's probably with, – with the last name Winsky, you're going to have uh, several oh, nicknames. Of so. Yeah. Uh, no. But but you guys ran well. Now, the interesting thing I think about that, because I was walking by when you were doing this, you were having a conversation with the Louisville guys, mm -hmm. and the Louisville guys, and, and you were the only non-Division One school there. And not only that, but Louisville, those guys from the 5K went to nationals. They did. Um, I went up to Edwin. Um, he was their top Louisville guy. And uh, prior to the race, um, I went up to him just asking him what his goal time was um, because – Ben and I, our goal was to maybe go out with them mm -hmm. um, if they weren't going out too blistering with pace. But when I asked Edwin, he said, uh, we're going to go around 1350s. And at that point, I knew that was way out of our league. Um, so I just told him, you know, good luck with that. And he asked me what our pace and our goal was. And uh, it was a pretty friendly exchange. And, you know, we were rooting for one another um, and hoping not to get lapped as well. <laughs> <laughs> Well, it was it was a, a torrid pace as I was there uh, taking pictures, but it is it, obviously you got within six seconds of the GMAC record. You set your own record. You broke your time by what your best time previously was fifteen oh five, and you ran a fourteen thirty three. Mm -hmm. uh, how does it feel when you beat a personal record, but in particular when you beat it by that much? It was just uh, I just had a great sense of euphoria. I when I crossed the line, I. I couldn't believe um, that just let alone breaking 15, that mm -hmm. was a goal of mine going in. Um, I knew I had three goals in mind. Um, the first goal, and my biggest priority would be to get the qualifying standard, which was 1444. Um, for the Nationals. For, na for Nationals. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then um, if I didn't hit that goal, the second goal would just be to break 15. And uh, past that would just be to get a PR. Yeah. And so um, to go and, and surpass those three and surpass my expectations of myself was just, um, it was amazing. And then uh, your buddy Ben Moroni, who you guys ran with a lot in Winsky, everybody did well, but Ben uh, set a personal record too, just to give, uh, give Ben yeah. uh, a little bit of love too. Yeah, Ben, he set a 30-second PR as well. Um, and going into the race, we were working together for the first uh, few laps, and I could tell he was looking smooth, and we mm -hmm. were talking during it. Um, and then just to pass and, and you know, cross the finish line and see that Ben had gotten a 15.05, it was incredible to see where we had come from, you know, a year ago. Yeah, and this is important because you're wanting to go to the Armory meet, which is a really big meet that uh, several of the athletes, I know Caroline Hampton is qualified for that, and Anna Hoffman too, mm -hmm. so congratulations to them. Yeah. He's Logan Rogers. He's the Great Midwest Athletic Conference Athlete of the Week for track for the first time in the 2015-2016 season. Thanks for watching.